What's up, everybody? How you doing? This is Max Boogie from Wall Street. And let me tell y'all, I really, really just messed up <laughs> with the rest of these videos. I recorded week 15, 16, and 17 with, with uh, Quincy Blunt and uh, Daniel Taylor. And I ended up deleting all of the games. Um, it was like a total of six. As you know, two and then three, two times, whatever. I deleted all the game. I was trying to go like real computer tech. I was like, you know, I gotta slow up my computer. I was like, did I did I put out these videos yet? Uh, I think I did. Deleted them. Deleted the whole folder. I cleaned mad stuff out of my computer. I'm like, yo, I'm good right now. Until I checked and I realized I deleted it off of the. Uh, Computer, it's, I deleted it out of the recycle bin as well because I really wasn't paying attention. I, it was so much stuff in that folder, I really just highlighted a whole bunch. And it, well, you know what I'm saying, I messed up, but I'm just going to explain to y'all what's going on right now. It, Dale Taylor is the NFL MVP of the season, even though he missed a couple of games in the season. He's still the MVP, and he's still. If you did, if you see that uh, the news page that was in the front, it said he was in the legendary status or whatever. I'm gonna show y'all the stats at the end of the season, but you saw that uh, Quincy Blunt was the defensive player of the year, swagging out, and I'm pretty sure because he was the MVP, Daniel Taylor the third was the offensive rookie of the year. And they're not even rookies to be honest. They already played one year in Madden 25, but you can't really go in like that. You can see Quincy Blunt's stats right here, man. One interception on the year. It's really crazy how I can't get interceptions on um, one forced fumble as well. You know what I'm saying? But we had over 100 tackles. <laughs> had 21 sacks. That's close to breaking the record, I think. I think the record's like 22 or something like that. But you can see Daniel Taylor's stats here, man. Averaging over six yards a rush. 20 over 20 touchdowns, bro. Averaging a, about 170 a game, crazy, bro. Amazing season by Daniel Taylor, and he missed a couple games. He broke the season record for rushing yards in a season, and he misses. He missed a couple games. I, I don't understand it. Man. It's like it's crazy, but um, uh, you could. I think I went over the bracket in the video already, but the bracket, the standings right now is the Falcons are in the wild card. And the Panthers are leading the division at 11 and 5. Falcons is 10 and 6 in the wild card. So the Panthers get to buy the first uh, playoff week, playoff buy. You see this news message right here. And you can see they both got selected to the Pro Bowl. Offensive player of the year, offensive rookie of the year. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. Best running back award, league leader in rushing yards. Daniel Taylor decided to kick up this year in the NFL. Missing a couple games. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Quincy Bunt did miss a couple games too. He missed like the first two, and I do remember that. But in the playoffs, though, Panthers got the bye week. Falcons in here got to play hard, try to get to the Super Bowl. And uh, if they don't, then they know who to blame. It's the offense, you know what I'm saying? Matt Ryan was like 25th. He was like 25th in, in passing, which is nowhere near like it is in real life. But somehow they, they allow this in match. I guess it's the offensive line's fault or whatever, but. I don't know. Um, oh, that's that's just the update, man. That's it for this video. But um, the video is coming to an end. So always remember, in the street we trust. I'm out.